Hi, this is Rob, your Prehab for Cancer Specialist Instructor. Today I'm going to do some adapted seated Tai Chi. Uh, the benefits of this is to help with breathing and circulation, flexibility and joint movement, uh, relaxation especially for those anxious about treatment and surgery, and can also help with insomnia from some studies already. For seated Tai Chi, you can use a sturdy chair, a sturdy box, or even the bottom three steps of your stairs. Ideally, you need a flat surface that's level and somewhere that you find relaxing and quiet. We're going to start with some mobility. So just sit yourself forward on your chair. Make sure your back's away from the backrest. I'm going to start using the neck and the head. Make sure posture's nice and straight. I'm going to move the head to the right, then to the left. Back to the centre to the right, center, and left. Next, we're gonna look down, and then slowly up to the sky, back to the center, and down again. All these movements should be done within your own range of movement, and nothing should be pushed too hard. Next is ear to shoulder, again nice and relaxed, you shouldn't feel any strain as you do this. Next is shoulder shrugs, forwards to back to start with, I'm going to do four of these and then we're going to do backwards to forwards. Always finishing off rolling backwards to forwards so the shoulders are back, chest is out nice and straight. Next, we're going to loosen up the back by doing some side twists with loose arms. Nice and gentle. Keep that back straight. And then we're going to roll forward, vertebrae by vertebrae, stretch it out. Make sure our breathing is in control as well. So we breathe out as we go down and slowly breathe in as we come up. Next is side bends. So imagine you've got a plane of glass in front and behind. From here, we're going to keep the back straight. We're going to take one side down, hold it there, and come up again. So we're going to breathe out as we go down, hold, and breathe up on the way out. Make sure this back is not leaning forward or back. Keeping the core nice and strong. Moving on to the dragon punch now. As you draw the hand back, imagine you're bringing in the energy and you're pushing out any stress or tension. Bringing in that positive energy. You can do both hands together. Breathing in as we draw in and out as we push out. Moving across to the sides now, one at a time. I'm going to do four on one side, four on the other. Keep a strong core all the way through this movement. Again, drawing in the energy, pushing out any stress or tension. This is a good time to concentrate on our breathing and reset our posture if it needed to. Shoulders back, chest out, tummy in tight, in for the nose and out for the mouth. If you can't do in through the nose, just breathe in for the mouth and out for the mouth. Moving into tiger now. As we raise the hands, take a deep breath in for the nose, 
As the hands come down, palms out, breathe out through the mouth. Nice deep breath in and out. The arms should move in the same speed as you're breathing. So as you breathe in at the top, you should then start to breathe out as you come down to the bottom. Moving into holding up to heaven. Bigger deep breath in this time. We're going to push up and down again. Breathing out as we come down. Big deep breath in. Palms face up to the sky. Push up and back down again. Taking in the energy as we raise those arms. Pushing out the tension as we come down. Moving into another set of side bends and dragon punches, same as before. Remember, with the dragon punches, really concentrate on that core area, it's pushing the belly button in towards the spine, tensing in the stomach. Make sure you're still relaxed though, and it feels comfortable. Another chance to concentrate on our breathing and posture. Place one hand below the belly button and the other hand on top. Concentrate on that breathing with the shoulders back, the chest out, tummy in nice and tight. Another set of holding up heaven. Complete this four times. Moving on to the energy pool. Start with a hand across the face, palm outwards, slowly drop down. Imagine you're scooping up some energy from a pool. Take the palm out, come across the face, drop that hand down. As we're coming up, we're going to breathe in. As we bring the hand down, we're going to breathe out. Do this four times on each side.
back to Tiger and holding up heaven. Moving on to deer, raise the palms out, slowly take one hand down to the side, breathing in, bring the hand round, push out, breathe out. We then follow up with the opposite hand. Take the hand down, breathe in, bring up to shoulder height, palm out, push out, breathe out. We do this four times on each side. If you have any shoulder injuries or pain, you can rotate the shoulder instead. Next is round the worlds. With the palm facing in, take the hand up, breathe in. As you go past the shoulder, rotate the palm out, breathe out. As you come in again, breathe in. Going to alternate on arms, four on each side. Keep the posture straight, core nice and strong. We're going to repeat holding up heaven.
back to energy pool. Four sets on both sides. Finishing off with Tiger and Deer, four sets of each. To complete this session, we're just going to release the back. Slowly lower yourself down as far as you can go and slowly come back up. Remember good posture at the end. We're going to breathe out as we take our hands slowly down the legs as far as you can and then breathe in through the nose as we come back up. If you're feeling faint or dizzy as you go down, just stop there and stay up straight until you get back to normal. Next is Tiger, taking the palms a little bit higher than normal, nice and gentle. Keep those palms open and relaxed. Again, four times with this. Finally, we're going to gently tap our thighs and the bottom of our legs and then take it to the outside, same again. And to finish off, just going to wiggle the fingers and the toes. You're all done. 